Hey everyone, it's Melanie and I just wanted to show you all how I did these lock pedal bangs and top bun. See what everybody thinks. This top bun method um, is pretty similar to the one I did before in my other video. I just added twist to the side. So when I was pulling all the hair up to the top of my head, I just took my hair and twisted it up and then bobby pinned it down. And then did the same method as I did with the top bun. So check out my top bun video on short locks if you haven't already to see how I did that in more detail. The lock pedals are really simple. I probably should have used clear bands on these, but I'll take this one out so you can see what I did. I wasn't sure since I have an ombre and the ends of my hair were actually going to be meeting at the black parts at the tops of my hair, so I wasn't sure if I should be using brown or clear rubber bands. But basically, you use these tiny rubber bands. You can get them at your local beauty supply store, CVS or Rite Aid. Uh, mine were like 99 cents. Uh, for a pack of like, I want to say 200 maybe. So here's a close up of one of them. You basically just take the end of your lock, if you have short locks, and rubber band it to the base of your lock. And again, clear would have worked better for me because you can see these light brown rubber bands, but this is the first time I really did it with rubber bands. So I take my lock. I just fold it in half and I hold it at the end of the base of my lock and then I just rubber band it. You want to make sure you're pinching oops, you want to make sure you're pinching it together or you'll slip the rubber band. So I put it at the base of my lock. I have the end meeting the base here, put the rubber band over and I pinch and then I double it and there you go it's so simple you can do your whole head like this if your locks are um, even mine are in like a bob shape right now just because I had a bob when I started my locks and I got lucky they kind of grew out in that similar shape so that is how you do them and then I kind of just pull them over to the side to create a cute side bang. You really can't see the rubber bands too much, so it's really your personal preference if you're going to be nitpicky. I'm not going to leave these in for very long, it's just a temporary style, but if you end up doing your whole head, it can be kind of time consuming. So you may want to consider really making sure you have the right color rubber band before you start, unlike me. <laughs> so this is a updo style that I like to do for work. Um, or like a formal occasion, or if it's just hot and I want to get them off of my, um, like out of my eyes. I mean, they're kind of in my eyes a little bit, but not as much as they would be as they were if they were out. So yeah, I'm just trying to style them again, push them over to the side, um, keep them kind of controlled a little bit. Anyway, this is a great cute style for dramatic updo, uh, and it's great to do with short locks and still achieve that fun lock pedal style that other people do with long locks. Let me know what you think. Like, share, subscribe, and comment in the comments below. If you have a lock pedal updo that you love to do on your medium length locks, let me know. Take pictures, share. I would love to see what you guys are doing. All right, that's it for today. Talk to you later. Bye.